what's up? It's your boys and B, and we want to give a shout out to our boy Gallo, the yep. guy you know. Yes, sir. Yeah. It's been really different just because our music has changed. So obviously the fan, fans are going to change. Uh, the last time I had seen them, I was like 17 years old. I'm 20 years old now. So, you know, they are all grown up. Gone, you know, a lot of them gone freaky. So it's kind of weird to see them now. Because like the fan that we used to see that used to be like, this is number one good. Now I'm being like, what's up, boo? And I'm just like, nah, not like that. But I mean, it, it feels good and I'm down the road with me. So it's like, I just feels like, it's like we're bringing the R&B, soul, hip-hop, pop, boy bands yeah. back, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So good. Good. Sure. yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Jonathan, what's been one of your favorite cities so far? Oh, Anytime man, other than Chicago, obviously, y'all right. lit. Right. Philly, man. Oh, Philly, Philly showed, showed mad love. Yeah. It was crazy. For me, Detroit, uh, it, it was crazy because they didn't have right security. So they was turned up and they knew I was from the home city and that was crazy. So it was yeah, EJ's dad was like, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> 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 it was crazy. It was yeah. crazy. So what's been uh, one of the craziest things that's happened so far on this tour, fan-wise? Craziest. Thing? So yesterday, a fan yeah. opened the door. Like we said, we didn't have security, uh -huh. so a fan was like, open the what? door. And they literally opened the door and, to and our car, to, like, our car door. Like close the door, open and close the door. Yeah. That was banging crazy. on the window, banging on crazy. the windows. Yeah. It felt like a hailstorm. Oh, so actually, like, funny story. Yesterday we were in Detroit and we were at a mall. And these three fans came up to us and was like, my, you know, MB, my last favorite. But they didn't know that we were doing the main greet, like down the oh, street. Okay. So I was like, come on, come to the main greet. But she said it was her birthday and she had a big old party. Oh, yeah. So I said, you know what, if you bring all of your friends to the main greet, after the main greet, we're going to mm -hmm. come to your party. And I didn't think she was going to do it. 15, 15 of her fans in the family <laughs> came. Like, we seen y'all tonight, and we ended up going to a birthday party. It was It was legit. I mean, at the end of the day, that's 15 more fans that we probably didn't have before, and now we do, and they're like friends now. So. Yeah, exactly. And exactly. when we showed up, she was like crying, and she, she didn't think we were going to show up, and we partied with her all night. So. That's another thing that yeah. separates us from, you know, a lot of artists, like a lot of artists go to the different cities and just like, oh, sign the autographs, and they, you know, kind of have their egos yeah, and stuff. It was like, we, we want to connect with our fans, you know, their family to us. And it's fun. Yeah. We make it more fun that way anyway. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I'm, 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 so annoyed, I'm so annoyed by these two. I need new people in my life. I'm just yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's that shit yeah. I'm on. Freaks only. What's one of your favorite songs you either written or produced or like just like and one you love to perform? Mm -hmm. Wanna perform? I think well, we've only really performed I Want That and Overnight Bag at yeah. the Experience. Yeah. But I think or the one record perform. that's gonna be dope to perform is Freaks mm -hmm. and Come Up. Oh, I think mine is uh Or dance therapy, because that's gonna be like a high. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be super dancey. I think for me music or music dub. Or blur. Music oh yeah, blur. that's gonna be. Yeah, I forgot about blur. I would say, uh, blur. That's probably my favorite one to do. Yeah, uh, that's, that's gonna be exciting. really, really lit. Cause yeah, we just gonna get the whole crowd and be lit. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Behind the screen right now. Playing for the rest of the year. I know you are going on tour. So tour, yeah. That's the big ass for that ready. right now. Yeah, yeah we're just uh, doing other crazy. things right now, you know, promoting the album. Yeah. It's actually, but today it's made one month since the album came out. Yeah. Yeah. And it's debuted at number three on Billboard and made number one on iTunes. So it's been great so far, and we just can't wait to go on actual tour and 
perform and show the fans like the music. Too. And everybody that's watching right now, thank you for all the support because like, it wouldn't be possible without y'all. So seriously, and stay tuned. Yeah. The story about to be lit. Bring back all the old stuff that NBA used to do. You know, performing, real performing, live. You know, but just add a little grownness to it. You know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> But yeah, I want to wish you the best of luck on you know the rest of this Thank promo you. tour and the tour the rest of the year. And it's Nick Gale, the guy you know, here with MD. Yes, sir.